Welcome to the Daily Bread. <laughs> About to leave in 45 minutes to head to Arizona, but first, back in the lab, recording more training, more new scripts, more, 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 more. <laughs> Flight was delayed, then flight was delayed way later. All because a flight attendant decided not to show up to work today. God bless America. So the next flight would have been tomorrow morning. So now we are speeding, of course now there's traffic, but um, speeding down the road to go to Charlotte, which was where our connecting flight was going out of. Now we're gonna try to uh, race against time here in the car. Waze right now says we'll be there at 7.06 p.m. The flight boards at uh, 7.25 p.m. Yeah, 7.25. <laughs> so we're gonna have to make up some time on the road here. And this is what we're currently working with. We uh, went down the median for about two miles, <laughs> but this is like half grass, half asphalt, and that's just a little sketchy. All right, we made it. The flight was actually delayed. This is a whole lot of stress for nothing. Actually, not for nothing. Pull some strings with a supervisor at the ticket desk and then had to sprint push people out of the way through security but we made it we're getting on the flight we're going to stay the night in charlotte and uh happy about that What's it like accelerating in this? So, so this Tesla S series, what is that? Um, this is very interesting. Like it's like a weird acceleration feeling. It's just like sheer, just like raw power, but like there's no like delay. It's just like, <laughs> like literally it throws your head back. Like you're like, oh God. <laughs> Which is freaking cool. Boarding? Okay. Right. Yep. So we're in full autopilot mode right now. We're about to get off on the exit, so we're trying to see if it's gonna get off on the exit for us. We have it into the We're GPS. not quite sure if it's gonna happen. 60s, but if we're in the right lane. I mean it can't change lanes. Maybe it can. Now take exit 55A, 55B on the right. In 1,000 feet. <laughs> it did it. It did it. It did it. I thought we were going into the median. Not gonna lie. I thought we were going to die. <laughs> we're about to take a turn. On a bridge. On a bridge. With no hands, oh Mom. Look, Mom, no hands. Oh my God, we are really taking this turn right now. I'm freaking out. I can get so much work done in this car. I'm buying one next weekend. What's up guys, we are uh, out here in Arizona. I think we're actually in Mesa, Arizona right now. Uh, just got back to the hotel. Uh, it's almost one o'clock here, so it's almost four o'clock back on our East Coast time. Um, but had a great day today. We um, helped teach a video workshop with Colby K. Um, and I think the people that attended uh, got a lot out of it. Uh, a lot of tactical stuff that they were able to take away that they'll be able to implement um, their personal branding and their in their businesses. So it was awesome. Uh, TJ did an awesome job. Um, I got up there and, and taught a little bit of stuff. Colby crushed it. Um, and there's just a lot of good value uh, that was provided um, coming out here a day early. So that was cool. And then got to connect with some really cool people um, at that event, but then also this evening, um, dinner, and then just hanging out at the uh, other hotel that the majority of the people are staying at um, this evening, just sitting around talking to people. And uh, as you guys know, I've got this um, 
this larger emphasis on having deeper connected conversations with people and able to do that now at scale uh, when we go places is just connecting with like so many people because when you come to an event like this like meltdown in the desert that you're going to see tons of footage of over the next uh, couple of days um, when you're surrounded by like-minded people you realize that those conversations are a whole lot more easily accessible um, because everyone's kind of on the same wavelength um, so super excited uh, for tomorrow, Saturday, Sunday, a lot of stuff that we're going to be doing, a lot of content that we're going to be able to uh, capture from this event. Um, there's something special about this Meltdown in the Desert event. Like everyone that's been always says that you can't really explain it, you just have to experience it. Like literally that's what everybody says. Um, so looking forward to experiencing that and uh, connecting further with some people that I've uh, connected with on social media from all over the country that are going to be kind of all converging on this uh, conference. So looking forward to that. We just wanted to knock out a quick um, little just kind of recap of the day um, to get out some blog content uh, because we are committed to doing this five days a week. Um, but we've had a long, 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 long day. I will mention I did my meditation, did my gratitude journal, and I ran five miles out here in this Arizona heat and it was brutal. So uh, with that guys, we will see you on the next one.